So another way to start it off some seeds is to buy these, which there's 12 of them in the pack, and they weren't very expensive. And they do um, you do have to put soil into them because they are empty. So you could buy stuff like this. I'm going to show you what they look like once they're open. If you don't like the um, the puck effect, now I did buy um, Miracle. Uh, grow soil to go in this. I'm going to show you that as well. Okay, so I have one opened. And actually there's two there. So, that's what they look like. You want to be careful because they are just uh, they're very easily uh, breakable if you're not careful. So, there they are. And it is a good, or a good size for starters. And I'm going to show you the soil that I have. And this is what we're going to put inside them. And it's supposedly for seed starting. And I'm just going to place it down for a sec while I open the bag here. I do um, think that if you're going to spend the money, you might as well spend it on good fertilizer or good soil because... You definitely um, need that to be successful in whatever you're planting. Now, I'm going to plant uh, green peppers in my little cup. So, I'm going to take a cup and I'm going to fill it with soil here in a sec. The bag's giving me a bit of a trouble, so opening it. Miracle Grow does make some great products. I'm just going to show you inside the soil. And as you can see, it does look great for soil, for sure. I fill my little cup up. And then we're just going to place it on the table. And we're going to just pat it down a little bit. And then we're going to get a seed and put it in there. It's okay if I make a mess, I clean all my messes. So we're going to plant the peppers, which are right here. And I want to um, plant about, probably 12, I'm probably going to plant 12 peppers because I do like a lot of peppers. And because in Canada the season so short for gardening, you have to start a lot of things indoors and in order for me to be able to plant these later out into the ground I'm gonna to have to start them now so these pots are actually really fantastic for that because of the fact that they are pretty biodegradable and they go back into the ground and I really don't want to leave a big carbon footprint on things so if I can reduce my um, my carbon footprint by even a little bit and you'll find that if you recycle and reuse as well not only are you making your carbon footprint a little smaller but you're also saving yourself some money as well and I'm definitely about saving myself some money so I guess that's why it's cheapskate and there's some seeds that I'm going to use so like and subscribe and watch for the updates. I'm just going to push that seed right down, cover it up, and then I'm going to water it and hope for the best and keep watching for updates. Have a great day.